Hi everyone, I'm just sharing with you all a little project which I've done in the van and what I've done is I've replaced the stereo with a much better one but also underneath it I've added this information display which shows the battery percentage, the cell voltages and the volts, amps and watts. So this is based on the Canna project, it's just this Nissan Leaf display but of course with the ENV200 being almost identical electrically it just works the same so I 3D printed just uh, a plate for it just to make everything look all neat and also uh, just a single DIN 3D printed box which also goes behind this so it's in the prototype stage and it's just got this button here where I can like switch the thing on and off um, but I just need to be careful with it because I don't want to be going into the cell voltages and temperatures because the problem with doing that is while you're driving or charging it's quite critical apparently uh, in some cases if it interrupts the CAN bus at the, at the wrong time you could get some serious problems so I'd only ever use that uh, to check the cell temperatures when the van's not charging and it's just sitting still but when you're reading the uh, like the currents and also the percentages at the start that's just listening on the CAN bus so it's not actually sending anything so it doesn't interfere it doesn't seem to be affecting the functioning of the van at all and it's just like good while I'm driving so I can see how much power overall is coming out of the battery and this button is just here so I can switch it off but if I do a later version of this I'll have a system whereby if the battery voltage of the 12 volt battery goes like down below 12.6 volts it will just switch itself off because it's always over 12.6 volts when the van is on anyway um, there is a switched cable in there so that when the van's like switched on it has 12 volts going to it but that goes off even when the van's charging so I've just got this sort of on all the time system but ideally I would have had the display which is twice the size of this but the circuit board for it just does not fit um, but I'm going to revise this anyway uh, but yeah I'm happy with the project we've also got the button which controls everything and the little contrast adjuster screw in there so yeah I'm just having a rapid charge before I go off to see uh, a nice hockey match with one of my friends so um, hopefully that all goes well.